Hey peeps, in today's video we'll be setting up the longer camera kit with our longer B1 diode laser. If you're interested in longer machines, make sure to use our discount code Project 5 Off for 5% off at checkout on their website. We'll have the links and details in the description. Now that our camera is set up, we'll calibrate the lens and light burn. This kit came with the circle pattern, so we're just going to move that around where it tells us to and capture images. The next step in calibrating our camera is to align it with Lightburn.
We'll now do a test engraving to see how accurate the camera is. Then we'll be able to adjust the camera accordingly after we update the overlay. After updating the overlay, we can see that the engraving is not accurately lined up with the camera, so we can go ahead and adjust that. Now after setting up and installing this longer camera kit, here's some of our initial thoughts. Now some of my critiques for this camera kit is that though not flimsy, it is very easy to bump this and get it out of alignment pretty easily. Additionally, I would have liked there to be a little bit more wire management as this cord just kind of hangs here if you don't kind of set it out of the way. And I'm just waiting for the day that the laser head snags the cable and pulls it out of the computer. So just something to note there, you're gonna wanna make sure you keep this wire clear of the laser head and gantry. Now on the other side, I have to say that the mounting hardware here is pretty sturdy. This is mounted really well on the back side of the laser. It is pretty adjustable to get the camera where you need it to be in your workspace. Additionally, at five megapixels, this camera is certainly powerful enough and with high enough resolution to get really good results and accurate results when setting up in Lightburn. I also like the fact that we could use this camera setup on any of our gantry systems. So it's simply a plug and play system to use with really any gantry. In addition, you could use this camera head in Longer's enclosure. Now setting up in Lightburn was very, very simple. Again, uh, the camera picking up the circle diagram that comes with the camera kit, by the way, which is really nice. They picked those circles up really easily and we got uh, good, alignment results right from the gate. And now with Lightburn, it's very easy to adjust that alignment. If so, if you do bump it accidentally, you could easily realign it. So overall, I think that this camera kit is absolutely useful with any gantry, but certainly for this B1, I would definitely get it. And certainly at this price point, it's a good camera setup. And I absolutely love the fact that it takes out the whole framing aspect of using the laser head to frame out your job. You could use and fully utilize your scrap material to get smaller projects within the gaps very, very easily and efficiently use your material, which I definitely like. 
We'll have the link to the longer website in the description if you're interested in the laser we used or this camera kit. And make sure to use our discount code project 5 off for 5% off longer machines. Also make sure to stay tuned for more upcoming videos covering the longer B140 watt diode laser engraver and some of its compatible accessories. Thank you so much for watching this video, I hope you enjoyed it.